My name is Jason Bardermaski. I was just interviewed and now I am interviewing Beth Carter, uh, an amazing artist, sculptor, who I am very happy to be showing with now at the same gallery. Your, your sculptures have such an emotion to them and the way you manipulate the form to kind of create that emotion, it's so expressive. Can you talk a little bit about what drives, you know, behind what we just see, phys you know, physically as a sculptor? Or sort of physically how I make things and physically, how but, I put the emotion emo into yeah, it. The emotional aspects. Um, I think with my work, I uh, most of my ideas come from an internal um, feeling first. That's how they. That's the. That's the how they. The germinate kind of thing, um, and. Um, you know, I, I only make work about things I feel very strongly about. So if I'm moved by an idea, um, I guess when I'm making it, when I'm physically modeling the piece, um, that somehow that, that feeling, that emotion, you know, is invested in the material. I can't really explain it more than that. I mean, that's what happens. Um, and then other people see it and connect with it, which is amazing. This piece, um, it kind of follows a theme of a lot of what I, a lot of what my work's about, which is uh, I'm quite interested in the duality of, uh, well, just duality as, as a concept, I suppose, and the kind of um, reconciling uh, uh, kind of difficult forces. So with this one, I have a giant and a small girl, and you'd assume the giant is the stronger kind of, you know, more dominant force in, in the balance, but actually the vulnerable small girl is leading him and so I, I like to just play around with the balance of those things and you know I, I think I don't know there's something kind of sad about him there's a lot of sadness in my work as well a lot of grief and issues like that with there's something very beautiful it's more of a melancholy I think than, than sadness I mean I don't know what the difference is but yeah that's melanch I love melancholy I love melancholy music I love yeah it's a great word it is it's lovely isn't it <laughs>